everybody. See you out there. We're working for you. And one of the things I know everyone out there wants to see, Tina, is yeah. toys. We love toys. Toys. Gadgets. Gadgets. So yes. we brought Shree down from hey, Shree, nice to meet you. Nice Thanks to for meet coming you. down. And Appreciate it. look at these badass laptops. And we'll get to this later. Don't cut ahead. Tell us about these laptops and what is this little gadget to running here on the, co on the cover of it? All right. So these are new prototypes that we've built on the Windows Sideshow team. Mm -hmm. And the cool thing about these is that they're all connected to the power of Windows Vista. So okay. Okay. they're going to launch uh, when Windows Vista launches. You'll start seeing these kind of devices out in the market. So this first one I have here is a little display built into the lid of the laptop. Mm -hmm. And it's always running. It's running when my PC is turned on. It's running when my PC is turned off. Now so how, the cool just thing, like, how is it running when you have no power? It's connected to the laptop battery. Okay. Um, it uses very little power. So you can imagine your cell phones already last like a couple of days, but you hook that to the power of a laptop battery, it's going to last you weeks. You say it's display. running. What, what's it doing? Because right now I just right see now, a clock. The most important thing, <laughs> people use it for time. But I can drill in, oh, wow. and I can get a whole bunch of information right from the lid. So first thing, my calendar for the day. Mm -hmm. This is like the most important thing to That's me. Handy. Yeah, I look at it all the time, and every time I need to do it, when my laptop's uh, turned off, when it's in standby, I need to open up the laptop, log in, yep. get my data. So this is a really cool way for me to get my entire schedule for the day. So we can see I was supposed to be at the studio at 9.30. I can get the details for the appointment. That's great. All this without ever having to open up or turn on your laptop. Yeah, and it's, it could be always running, yep. And now what, access. what software is this, is this running? So this little um, prototype device here is actually running something what we call the uh, Tiny CLR or the .NET Micro Framework. Mm -hmm. It's a little OS that's powering this device. The important thing is, it really doesn't matter what this device is running. This is something that we prototype within Microsoft, but any software um, or any hardware vendor out there could build their own device. It right. could be an existing device. Um, it could be a new device they're thinking about, but oh. they could run Windows Sideshow on their own device, running their own operating system. But it, now, does it have to, so it has to be anything with an operating system. It can't be any kind of a portable device. Like, can, I, can this gadget work on anything else? Uh, so this gadget can work on any device that's made, built to work with Windows Sideshow. Okay. So you can take any device that's out there, any device um, that has a display on it, and basically modify it to work with Windows Vista. So, only Vista, right? Is this vi This Vista is Windows only? Vista only. So mm -hmm. it's going to come out um, okay, end of the year. I like so, Vista. Yeah. So Vista. there's. So now you guys manufacture or build this, um, the piece here that you install, and then can you put it on any laptop? Because I said you, you have both of these on this Asus brand. Yeah, so you can put it on any laptop. So we're making this an open platform. Okay. So any person out there can build these devices, mm -hmm. and any person out there can supply these kind of little gadgets that run on these devices. So I showed you my calendar, and yeah. I can show you a lot of cool other things that are running. Is this one different? This one seems a little bit more sporty. Yeah, that one is, is a little different. <laughs> So this is kind Robert. of the upscale model, um, oh, cool and trendy. Um, yeah, so you can see it's pretty much the same concept. It's always on, always running. Mm -hmm. But the cool thing here is it pops out. So I can take that right out of the oh, laptop. Okay. So, yeah, so I love it's portable. That. <laughs> it is portable. So, so I, that, does that mean, that, can, I, can I order this after I bought it, ordered my laptop? So if you'll notice, it's got a pretty um, built-in docking system okay. here. So we expect some of these to be um, built into the laptop, okay. but some of these could be like your portable music player, maybe even your iPod, but it could be any device that has could, a display. Or like your phone. That yeah. could totally be something you might want to work on and think on about building. Oh, about <laughs> the phone? Oh, we're already working on that. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I, so. I, I can't copyright it. Volume down, volume, volume down. What is this? What is this for? It's pretty self-explaining. It's uh, remote control, um, but it works with Media Center. so. The cool thing about that is, OK, so I have this situation at home quite a bit. I'm sitting on the couch watching TV with my wife, and we're flipping channels. Yes. And I get the guide on there trying to figure out what we want to watch next. Mm -hmm. And she's like, come on, get back to the show. So this will probably let you look at the channel guide right on the remote control, preview channels that, are, that you want to look at. So it puts a UI in front you of you. You have just with... saved so many marriages. I know, oh. seriously. <laughs> I mean, you really have. That is. So you can watch live TV right here you'll on the probably get control. That, you'll probably get some kind of preview of what's on that channel. Yeah. I wouldn't say it's the best thing to view TV on that, um, on that little screen. Mm -hmm. You have a big, nice TV so in front of you. So how do I get this? Uh, so this is a prototype right now, and we're working with partners right now okay. to 
kept them enthused and, and like excited about building it. I know She's there's excited. A, there's a I'm lot of, so excited about there, this one. There's a lot of buzz in the community. I mean, people have seen this. They're excited by it. And now it's just figuring out the technical details, getting it right out there in the market. Well, I'm a beta tester yeah. part-time. Uh, so <laughs> that's awesome. But for someone who watches less TV and is more concerned with work, yeah. um, what is the price range on something like this? Because this, this looks perfectly handy right here. Right. So it really depends on what the device does. So that one out there could what be... What do you think? Yeah. I know you probably don't have it nailed down exactly. Oh, yeah. Or... So that's going to be a portable music player plus um, doing other things for you. So it would probably cost... Like, we've run this by some users, like the $200 price point range. Mm -hmm. And okay. that's like similar to an existing music player. Sure. sure. And you just add some extra functionality to it, add more value to it. So that's what we're thinking. It's similar to existing devices, but we're just adding new capabilities. So I'm really excited about the possibilities with Sideshow. Well, where Me can too. we get all the information of what you guys are working on? So there's more information on the uh, Windows Vista website. We link to Sideshow from there. Great. Great. And we're going to link to it right here below us on yes. our show. So we're going to expect this with the launch of Vista late this year. Could be January two th 2007. Mm -hmm. Hopefully sometime soon. Thank you so sometime much for coming soon. on. Oh. Thank really you. Cool. Sideshow. Fun toys. Yes. So a digital picture frame. We could have like me cycling. And have like all your shows right. and yeah. then like your pictures. Like me when I was 15. <laughs> and then just how many? Laura with the braces.